Let me say, your three children have intelligence, have a fantastic sense of humour, and it's an absolute delight because they're all so different. But... Commitment. Enthusiasm. It's not here. But somewhere along the line, that's been forgotten. Let's talk about discipline. Where is discipline in this house? Uh, I'm not very good at it, so I'm, I just don't know what I'm doing. I, I try. I mean, I'm only here on the weekend, so... Punching, kicking, slapping. Why do you guys tolerate that behavior? Well, I don't think it's acceptable, but how do you deal with it? You don't deal with it. Ethan was playing with his basketball and Isabella thought it was okay just to go over and say to Ethan, I want to play. Mm -hmm. I heard you turn around and say to Ethan, let Isabella play. Well, I have told her when, you know, that she needs to ask nicely. I didn't realize that that is how she approached him about playing. But you were in front of her when that happened? No, I wasn't. Well, I was there and I know you was there. I was in the kitchen. I didn't hear what was going on. I beg to differ. Okay. I beg to differ because I think that actually what is happening is that you're seeing a lot of things and you're ignoring it. And I think you are as well, Terry. The routine. Well, there isn't one that creates any time for the children to be creative. They do that. You can't say you didn't see that because they had paper here, they had crayons, they were drawing. And what were you doing? I don't know. That's my point, Lisa. They want to sit down with Mummy and say, look what I've done, and you make one as well, and why don't you do anything like that with them? I don't know. I guess I'll start. Why don't you do it, Terry? Sit down and draw with them. The kids are bored. I was bored. Terry, you go to work all week. How many hours away? Three and a half. Three and a half hours away. Every week. Mm -hmm. And you finish when? Saturday. Exactly. Why do you choose to come home on a Sunday when you could be home on Saturday night? I don't know. Maybe I've been making some bad decisions. I've been selfish. Sometimes it's hard to hear the truth. When Joe broke down a lot of the problems, it hit home. It, it was very hard. Where are you making priorities to make sure that the pair of you have some form of a family life? Who's suffering here? The kids. The little time that we do have together, all five of us, you know, we're not making the most of it. I do agree with some of what Joe said. However, I would have appreciated for our meeting to be more of a meeting instead of the confrontational tone that she used with us. Are you both willing to put in 100% commitment? Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay, so let's start work. <laughs>